In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to use Westlaw to find cases. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. Using Westlaw to browse through different cases, regardless of the state or type of case, is extremely simple. All that you have to do is visit their website and go to the dashboard after you are signed in. Once you are signed into your account, as long as you have a trial or subscription active, you will have the ability to browse through various cases. Usually, it is going to be the first option linked under the table of contents on the home page. You can also use the search function at the top and filter them by state, by court, or by circuit. So, all that you have to do to actually use Westlaw to browse through cases, as you might expect, is to select the option from the table of contents. Immediately upon choosing cases, you will have to filter them. There are plenty of ways to filter them, federal cases by court, by circuit, by state, and then other US jurisdictions and topics. Regardless of which option you pick, you will be able to open some of these documents as long as they fall within your subscription agreement. So for example, since I have the trial, I won't have access to all of these specific cases, but you, if you have a valid subscription, all of them will be accessible by you. So choose any of these filters and immediately all the cases on that specific state will be displayed. So just filter them as necessary and they are going to appear over here. Usually the most recent documents are going to be displayed on my case. You can click on any of them to see the details. You can see the date over here and more information regarding it upon entering on the specific case. You can then browse through the results over here and everything will be widely available for you to see. You have options over here to show key side flags if you are using this for academic purposes or any sort of research. And like I said, everything is available for you to read, email, forward, etc. You can go into the table of authorities and take a look here whenever you select any of the currently available cases. I hope I was able to help you on how to use Westlaw to find cases. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.